8 Things You Shouldn't Do If You're Taking Apple Cider Vinegar Although apple cider vinegar, or ACV for short, has numerous health benefits. There is a right and wrong way with everything. Going the wrong route could be very hazardous and harmful. Taking it straight. If you're thinking about drinking apple cider vinegar straight and then eating or drinking something else to hide the bitter flavor, you should reconsider. While there are numerous health benefits to taking ACV in this manner, it may be more dangerous than beneficial. Because of its acidic nature, ACV has the potential to irritate and harm the esophagus and stomach. To spare yourself a lot of trouble, always dilute your ACV with water. Apple cider vinegar can be made more attractive by diluting it with water to protect your throat and stomach from the acid. If it still bothers you, apple cider vinegar can be found in various, more enjoyable forms, such as apple cider vinegar gummies. Drink it right after eating. If you're used to sipping apple cider vinegar after a meal, you might want to change this idea. On an empty stomach, apple cider vinegar may provide health benefits. Many people, especially as they get older, have declined gastric juices, and ACV can aid in the digestion of meals. ACV, taken just before eating, can help to replace these lost gastric fluids, allowing food to digest more quickly. The result is that you may experience less bloating or indigestion after eating. Another way to reap its benefits is by trying it as part of a salad dressing. Breathing it in. It's better not to take a big whiff of ACV because it can induce an unpleasant reaction in the nose or eyes. Remember, it's vinegar, and vinegar has a strong odor that can affect some people. As you sip it, be careful not to inhale, or at least not deeply. The suggested way is to dilute ACV is with some water to your preferred taste to help diminish the pungent vinegar smell. 2-4 to four ounces of water mixed with 1-2 to two tablespoons of ACV is a decent ratio for many people. This dilution is also essential for the protection of your teeth and esophagus. Take swigs of it. Even when diluted, apple cider vinegar is still an extremely acidic substance. Because ACV is highly acidic, it might harm tooth enamel. So, if you're wondering how to drink apple cider vinegar, don't just drink it out of a glass, even diluted. Instead, Drink it using a straw to ensure that it does not come into touch with your choppers. After ingesting apple cider vinegar, wait at least 30 minutes before cleaning your teeth. Start by drinking lots of it. Apple cider vinegar is good for your health, here's what you can expect if you drink it regularly. Isn't the old saying right more is better? Wrong. Too much of a good thing is harmful, and apple cider vinegar is no exception. You should avoid taking too much ACV at first, especially if you're new to it. It's a good idea to take things slowly at first. This will help you figure out how your body reacts to it. If it creates an upset stomach or a burning feeling, reduces the dosage until no sensation is felt. Furthermore, acclimating to the flavor will be easier if you start modest and gradually increase. Even if everything goes smoothly and you have no problems, you should never use more than two tablespoons at a time. When diluting it in water, Limit your intake to 2 tablespoons to protect yourself against harmful or uncomfortable side effects. Drink it right before bed. While it is a good idea to take apple cider vinegar before eating, it is not good to take it before bed. Because ACV has the potential to creep back up the esophagus, it is not recommended to take it right before sleeping. Even if the ACV is diluted, if the acid gets into touch with your esophagus while you're lying down, it might cause damage. People should remain upright for 30 minutes after taking it, regardless of the time of day, to avoid reflux and esophageal irritation. It is recommended to drink ACV at least half an hour before sleeping. Take it if you have stomach ulcer. While apple cider vinegar can help with digestive health in general, there are particular gastrointestinal ailments that this acidic chemical will aggravate. If you have Helicobacter pylori, a type of bacteria associated with ulcers, for example, Unfortunately, apple cider vinegar and its acid might irritate it even more. If you have any doubts about drinking ACV, regardless of the reason, consult your doctor beforehand. Put it directly on your skin. It's not always necessary to drink apple cider vinegar to benefit your skin. ACV can be used for its cosmetic properties. It may aid in the treatment of acne and dandruff and the relief of sunburn. However, there is a proper and improper technique to apply ACV to your skin. Whether you're using ACV as a toner, blemish remover, or infection treatment, it's critical to dilute it and keep it away from your skin. Prolonged exposure to the highly acidic vinegar can actually kill skin cells, erode your skin, and even leave you with semi-permanent chemical burns. So again, 
Sticking to 1 part vinegar to 8 to 10 parts water is the recommended amount. Please give it a thumbs up and share it with any family or friends who find it helpful. Thank you for watching, and please hit the subscribe button.